Explain. Basically, it was a nightmare, Hannah. It was awful <laughs> to try and like have to constantly say yes. I like. I think it's really important that we fight fight against this injustice. But also, here's another one. Like my white colleagues and people I was working with perceived that as a direct attack on them and their character. And I thought that was particularly shocking for people who could see injustice so clearly in other sort of areas of society. When I wrote that post with the title that it had, which was why I'm no longer talking to white people about race, an explanation, you know, it, I really wanted simply to be understood. Racial injustice wasn't something that I could ignore. Did you expect both the blog and then the book to be as hugely successful as they've been? So when I wrote the blog, I, it, wasn't, it wasn't on my radar. It hadn't occurred to me that it could be a book. But I do remember I posted it on my you know, personal website. Suddenly, it was being shared all around the world. And that's something I didn't expect because nobody read my blog before then. So <laughs> I had, there was no precedent. Like Nobody really cared what I had to say.